Sylvester Stallone is an actor who made an invaluable contribution to the Hollywood cinema of the 70s and 80s. The hero of the cult fighters has more than 50 films on his account, including six about the boxer Rocky and four about the fearless soldier Rambo, which made Stallone the idol of more than one generation. Sylvester was born on June 6, 1946, on the same day as George W. Bush. But, unlike the childhood of the future U.S. president, his early years were by no means joyful. The pedigree of the future actor is quite confusing. His mother Jacqueline Lebofish was born into the family of a successful Washington lawyer. It is unknown what made the girl, who grew up in affluence, connect her life in 1945 with an extremely irritable Sicilian Frank Stallone, whose family moved to the United States in 1932. Frank had a bad temper, he didn't miss a single skirt, he liked to drink. Sylvester was the first child. During the birth, Jacqueline had complications, the obstetricians had to use forceps. A common medical mistake of those times, the instrument pinched a nerve, the left half of Sylvester's face remained paralyzed for life. In the photo, the men of the Stallone family, Sylvester, his brother, the eldest son, and father. In 1956, Jacqueline, tired of her husband's constant debauchery, filed for divorce. Their separation, as well as the puny physique and birth trauma, seriously affected the character of Sylvester. At the age of 15, he ended up at the Charlotte Hall Military Academy for troubled teenagers diagnosed with attention deficit disorder. Sylvester Stallone's film career began with eroticism. In 1970, he received the male lead role in the movie Kitty and the Hertz Party. The photo is a frame from a movie. In 1970, he also starred in the film Nowhere to Hide. Then there were cameo appearances in Woody Allen's film Bananas, the film Clute, Prisoner of Second Avenue, as well as small roles in the TV series Police Story and Kojak. In the photo, a young Stallone. On March 24, 1975, Sly went to fight Muhammad Ali and the little-known boxer Chuck Wepner. Returning home in the evening, he did not go outside for the next 92 hours. That's how long it took him to write the script of a movie about a never-giving-up boxer. Rocky is a cult film that made Stallone a legend. After long negotiations, the producers agreed that Rocky would become Stallone himself. Filming was difficult because the actor had to transform into a professional boxer. He pounded on ice meat, rubbed his knuckles into blood, ran tens of kilometers every day, learned how to hold a punch. A shot from the first Rocky. Legendary photo, Stallone, Schwarzenegger, and Bruce Willis. Almost simultaneously with the third Rocky, the premiere of the film Rambo, First Blood took place. It was no longer an inspiring sports drama, but a bloody action movie, where Stallone appeared before the audience in the image of a Vietnam War veteran obsessed with a thirst for revenge. Interestingly, several high-level actors were invited to the role of Rambo. So, the likely candidate was Al Pacino, who planned to turn Rambo into a real psycho, which Stallone did not like as the author of the script. In 2010, Stallone assembled the old guard and presented to the audience something phenomenal, the action movie The Expendables, in which Jason Statham, Jet Li, Dolph Lundgren and Mickey Rourke took part in the cast. Two years later, the sequel premiered. It turned out to be even more spectacular because Chuck Norris, Jean-Claude Van Damme and Arnold Schwarzenegger joined the cast. Stallone in the Paparazzi Lens in May 2017 Stallone's first wife Sasha Zack, whom he married in 1974, before fame hit him. At that time, he did not believe in his own happiness. In the photo, Sylvester Stallone, Sasha Zack, and their children. 
In marriage, Sly had two sons, Sage and Sergio. The photo shows the eldest son Sergio, who died at the age of 36. Stallone's wife turned a blind eye to numerous infidelities with models, but she could not forget the affair with 22-year-old Bridget Nielsen. In 1985, she filed for divorce. In the photo, Sylvester Stallone and Bridget Nielsen. Sylvester and Sage Stallone After the divorce, the actor gave his all. The year 1988 turned out to be the most fruitful for him, in 365 days 88 models passed through his bed, including Naomi Campbell, Linda Evangelista and Cindy Crawford. Pictured with Linda Evangelista. In 1990, the already middle-aged actor seemed to have settled down. He met a model and his fan Jennifer Flavia. In the photo, the wedding of Stallone and Jennifer Flavia. However, in 1993, he had an affair with fashion model Janice Dickinson, which lasted about a year. The girl was a very relaxed person, she simultaneously had an affair with Liam Neeson, Jack Nicholson, and Bruce Willis. In the photo, Stallone with Janice Dickinson. Stallone is 24 and 66 years old. In 1995, he asked Jennifer on his knees for forgiveness for all his infidelities. Stallone is still married to Jennifer Flavia and is reputed to be an exemplary family man. The couple has three daughters, Sonia, Sistine, and Scarlett. In the photo, Sylvester Stallone with his wife and daughters in 2016. Sylvester Stallone in the movie Guardians of the Galaxy 2. In 2019, the fifth part of Rambo, with the eloquent title, The Last Blood, was released on the big screens. Sylvester Stallone and his daughter Sophie